Hello and welcome to Tabletop Oddity, my name is Jay and today I'm going to be doing a very quick unboxing of the Miner's Guild TIE Fighter for um, Scum and Villainy for X-Wing. Um, it's basically the only scum ship in the second edition wave. Um, so I'm just going to pop it open and we'll have a look at the cards and that kind of stuff. So yeah, let's crack on. So we're looking at the uh, Miner's Guild, uh, Mining Guild TIE expansion pack for the Scum and Villainy. Oh, you can see my face on the reflection. <laughs> Double me, how lucky for you. <laughs> um, yeah, we're looking at this, we're going to do it. It's going to be very quick unboxing because, um, you know, it's just one little, one box. But um, I've got to say, the pictures I've seen of this model are really exciting. I uh, really like the look of it. I don't personally play Scum and Villainy, but I'm fairly sure that will eventually change and I'll just end up playing absolutely everything because uh, we all like that. <laughs> so this is the uh, the expansion pack contents. Um, so the six ship cards, so um, that's basically six different pilots essentially. Uh, five upgrade cards, but I think all these upgrade cards, I think, are probably in the conversion kits. I don't think there's anything new here. Um, I could be wrong on that. If, if I am wrong, do correct, correct me in the comments. You get your quick builds and stuff like that. So uh, let's pop this <laughs> this bad boy open. Uh, what is a weird? What a weird phrase to say. Like, let's pop this bad boy open. You know what? I can never get this cardboard and this these bags. I can never get these out first try. I always get snagged on the bloody thing. And it's it's nothing to do with the design. I think it's just me and my incompetence. <laughs> but you know. That's my life. Obviously, you get your base and you dial um, the dial thing, the center bit, um, and of course we get the pilots. So, form and approach. And we'll have a little bit closer look at these. Um, he appears to be the highest uh, pilot initiative pilot form and approach. Uh, before you engage, you may choose one enemy ship in your bullseye arc at range one to two and gain one disarm token. If you do, that ship gains one tractor token. Pretty good. That could, you know, you could essentially send somebody off the board with that kind of stuff. So, um, yeah, really interesting. Uh, while you move, ignore asteroids. That's the whole uh, ability of the mining tie. I guess it's quite um, symbolic, like, you know, nice combination, nice synergy with the concept of it. These are your quick builds if you wanted them. Um, and then of course your upgrade cards, which I think these are probably, these. Are, I've seen at least all of these. I may have never seen that, but that doesn't mean it doesn't exist somewhere. Um, you know, just because I haven't seen it doesn't mean it doesn't exist. <laughs> um, and again, I really like the scum ones. I actually think the scum ones are probably the third best uh, dials. Really nice look uh, to the back of the dials there. Um, obviously you get your sh bot your ship. I don't know what these are called, the ship, play the pilot bases I guess uh, the dial itself let's have a look at the closer dial at this sorry I just keep I not the desk and the problem with knocking the desk is it knocks every single camera because this camera is actually connected to the desk and um, the dial it's got the 3k it's got a 5 forward and um, blue 3 forward and blue uh, twos all the twos except the hard twos are blue uh, one hard two uh, one hard two hard uh, three hard uh, and that's pretty decent there uh, yeah, that's a nice looking dial, isn't it? Really quite a maneuverable ship. That 3k, uh, very interesting. Uh, you get some stress tokens, you get your proof of purchase and that kind of stuff. And um, now obviously this ship doesn't come with any shields, but throw me a shield. <laughs> I love me some shields. You get some pi um, target lock numbers, some more pilot numbers, one of each token pretty much that you can use. Yeah, I mean, all in all, a nice little tidy kit. Uh, nice. Everything else is everything here that I've seen so far. Pretty nice. I really like the artwork on this card specifically. Uh, this tractor, in, I just really like it. Very nice. In fact, I love the artwork for a lot of these. You know, I said I didn't play Scum, but I might end up playing them. <laughs> uh, so what we'll do is I'll pop this one open, and uh, you know we'll we'll look inside of this. I've n I, if you know a way of getting this out without damaging absolutely everything in this box, do let me know. Because the only way I do it at the minute is completely like tear it to shreds, and that's what I'm gonna do right now. Well, this was one of my better ways of getting it out, um, but I'm not quite fully there. I've sort of kept most of the box intact, uh, you know, not all of it, but the best I'm going to get right now. And we'll pop it out like this. We've popped it out, and I'll just drop this on the floor like a boss. Um, yeah, and I'm not sure if the yellow's coming out like the correct shade of yellow on the camera. It does look pretty decent, pretty close. It feels a bit more like. Uh, natural shade of yellow here it looks a little bit uh, off I think that's just gonna be with the camera's white balance but you've got your little markings here for pre-painted I actually think this is pretty damn nice the level of detail here uh, these lines these stripes and stuff like that pretty pretty nice yeah I, I actually say I'm 
pretty damn impressed with the level of detail on this and I've got some nice shading in the recesses here um, yeah really nice I, the, the fact that there's patterns on this I think is like really showing some quality really that there's no there's no blurring or anything like that they are pretty damn crisp um, I, 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 isn't it weird but it's literally a TIE fighter with, without this front bit but that little difference makes it cool. <laughs> just really like it. Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what film or books or TV series this is in, but yeah, I really like this model. All in all, I think you know you get you you know what you're getting when you buy like a kit like this. Um, the artwork, I think FFG really stepped it up with the 2.0. Everything just screams like decent quality. The cardboard's quality, the art's quality, and the ships are looking fantastic. So that's that basically. Well, that was the Miner's Guild tie for the Scum Villainy faction. I mean, not my preferred faction. I probably won't end up properly seriously collecting them, but the quality of the ship, fantastic. And, you know, if, you, if you're if you a Scum player already, you'll know if you already want it. But I thought we'll have a quick look at the contents and then that'll be that. Um, if you like this video, do like. It really does help to like, like and subscribe. That really does matter to me So um, and helps the channel grow and that kind of stuff. Um, if you are, so yeah, do subscribe if you're not already. Thank you to my Patreons. Have a most beautiful day and goodbye.